Hello everybody, I'm doing well. Don't know what happened there, but I'm gonna keep it in. Anyways, <laughs> um, let's keep moving on. Uh, ooh, spicy bit of Eve, spicy bit of Eve. Okay, let's do it. But yes, anyways, anyways, before that bizarre intro happened, why did I do that? Do you know? Sometimes I'm dumb. Like, I could have just gone to my cash room and achieved the exact same effects I just achieved. I am a silly, silly goose. But, I was gonna say, our boy, Arthur, on the comment section of the, um, of the Binding of Isaac series, just hit a 200 comment streak. My lord, and also, hell yes, will be taking the D6. Also... Hell yes, I'll be grabbing this and using it to blow up this. Gimme, gimme. Goddamn, D6 this early? This, this is pretty awesome. This is pretty awesome. But yeah, Athol just, just reached a 100, no, sorry, 200 streak on the comments. And Manga, Manga also hit 100 recently as well. You boys, you boys do be popping off. You boys, gals, whatever you may be, do be popping off and it's... It's pretty goddamn amazing. Um, it's I appreciate an absolute ton. And to get the comment ball a rolling, to get some some jiggity jiggity jigginess. I'm I don't know what I'm talking about right now. I'm I don't know. I'm I'm in a strange mood today. Anyways, what I was gonna say is what what's a question? Oh fuck me. Ah, uh, what's a question any of y'all wanna ask me? Literally any question whatsoever. Ask me a question. What, what do you want to, it can be Isaac related, it can be me related, it can be any other game related, it can be anything. But, give me a, ooh, wait a minute, okay, give me a question of any kind. Right, um, this is a little, a little bit spicy, um, hmm, I kind of do want a bomb to get that glitched heart. Because it could be, it could be a red heart, but it could also be any other heart. Remember, the glitched hearts have been updated um, by me. I changed the code a little bit, just to make it so they drop one random heart rather than three. So, they're a little more common now, though. They're like a 5% chance to replace any heart rather, rather than a 1% chance. Might, that might be a little high, I'll be honest, but eh. I think it works for now. I'll tweak it as as blah, 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 as and when we need. God damn, I'm in a, such a strange mood right now. To be fair, I'm rec I'm recording relatively late, um, and I don't really know why. It's like half past ten. I don't normally record this late in the day, but I just kind of thought, you you little shysters, you little shysters, better give me better give me some good stuff here. I mean, spawn. I don't I don't even know what I want. I'm gonna be honest. I don't I don't even know what I want. By the way, I meant to get hit there. That's a penny. I don't want a penny. Okay, so... I don't know. I don't really really know what to think here. I'm not going to go alt path yet, just because I'm a little scared of my HP. Uh, I'm going to go normal path. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really know what to say here. Do you know what? Let's open it up. Okay, that didn't really work the way I wanted it to. Do you know what? I'm going to go. <laughs> I was going to check and see if it had a bomb or some pennies there, because sometimes it does. We got a little unlucky there. Ooh, we got a library. Ayo. Oh, and we got torn page as well. Amplifies or changes book activation effects or makes them charge faster. Apart from natural spawns, this trinket's 33% chance of spawn in libraries. Nice. Right, so. We want to grab that. Grab that. Grab that. I mean, technically, we should use this once at least to get some wisps. I really don't want to die to this, but... Um, excuse me? Well, this worked out. Okay, um... Not what I, not what I was expecting, but... I shall most certainly take it and be quite gracious. Uh, gracious? Grateful. I'm gracious, but I'm grateful. Okay, I'm a little worried we might die. Uh, just because, you know, I'm a major goober and all that sort of good stuff. Right, um, let me pop this. 
We got Book Revelations. Okay, I think we actually go... So we got Bookworm, good. We actually go pop this once, twice, three times a lady. Um. Okay, there you go. Right. I think I think we've got a good amount of wisps now, and we've got two soul hearts. Okay, I think I think I did that in the I didn't think I did that in the correct way. I think having two soul hearts and being still in horror Babylon puts us in a great great spot. I don't specifically know what Torn Page is doing for us in regards to the D6 um, book of book of revelation. Nah, not book of revelation. D6. Um, what the hell is it called? Book of Virtues, that's the one. Good old hive head. Uh, the completion of a room, spawn orbital bees, bee orbitals, block shots, and periodically bunny creep. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna roll on that, I think. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it rolling, rolling, rolling like a river. But I'm uh, I'm excited for the prospects of this run. This is like something I haven't seen in a little while, I'll be honest. A nice little uh Nice little Book of Virtues run, especially on the D6 as well. It's kind of an interesting uh, setup there. Do you know what? Let's uh, we, we definitely want to go Devil Deal, actually. So let's see if we can get a charge. I, I guarantee we're going to be one room off getting a charge here. Um, yeah, of course. Actually, no, technically we're not because um, we can do our boss. And that will give us a charge. So I am wrong. But we can get rid of, hopefully, our two hearts. And if we, go, if we roll up on in this boy with uh, a d6 charge then we can hopefully get one or two good items we are of course still using my mod that makes it so that we get at least two deals for sale every time which is gonna greatly help in the trading our two red hearts away uh, so we'll hopefully be able to do that the d6 um shots from our our, uh, our wispy boys seem to actually do pretty good damage okay so we'll leave we'll leave that there Wait, why did we get an angel deal exactly? I'm confused. Oh, no, it's because we got Book of Virtues. Right, okay. Okay. Hmm. I'm a little confused. Right. Actor control. We, even though this is going to give us an eternal heart, we don't really want one. Although, let's have a look. At the start of every room, a random familiar will get hyper buffed. Hyperbuff Familiars gain four times damage and increase in size drastically. That's very cool. I don't know how useful it's going to be. Oh, we could only take one anyways. Okay, that, that's fine then. I thought I thought it was going to let us take both. Sometimes I don't even know why I thought that. Like that's not how angel deals have ever worked. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna trash this fella just to um ruin his ruin his life, and then I'm gonna reroll the. Uh, we roll the old, um, ah, ah. We roll the old key piece to see what we can get. And then I don't know, do I want to take the HP? Because it will take us out of Horror Babylon. And unless we can get back to this confessional, we don't really have a way to get our HP gone again. Oh, what the? Where did you come from? Oh, Book of Revelations. Hey, yo. Yeah, Book of Revelations wisps do this. I forgot about that. Also, is it just going to keep hyperbuffing our bird? It's going to be kind of funny. All right, got to be careful here. Right, good, good. And we pop this, and we get Glyph of Balance. Hell yes. Right, is the angel... The angel is still open. So I'm going to grab this, and then go boom... Boom. Oh, I can see my health now. I got rid of my curses. Nice. I've actually got quite a lot of health. Do you know what? Get rid of the other one. Why not? Okay, cool. Glyph of Balance is, is pretty nutty. Pretty nutty. Um, Not much else to do this floor, I don't think. I think we're, I think we're pretty good to skedaddle skadoodle. God damn, this this run this run like I don't know, I was coming into this this episode, coming into this recording session, feeling a bit like out of it, feeling a bit weird, as you could probably tell. Whoa! It hyper buffed one of our wisps. Okay. Um this is an intriguing prospect. I didn't think it'd work on wisps, but apparently it do. 
Apparently it do. So now we've got some hyper buff wisps that, um... I don't actually know if they're dealing more damage or not, but I'm going to assume they are. But it's not really clear. But that's kind of an interesting prospect that I did not consider. Okay, make sure to pick up Red Hearts by accident. That would be moochier so bad. Oh, I was just about to say we kind of need a key. Thank you. Where? I never re-rolled my hive head on the last floor, did I? That's... That's dumb. I think I left an item behind on the last floor. I was just like, wait a minute. Where's our... Where's our... Uh, where's our hive head? Yeah, I didn't take it. I can't... I was coming back for a re-roll and never did. I mean, I'm not really that bothered because our stuff is pretty good right now. Like, our stuff is pretty damn good. But at the same time... Not really worth leaving for no, no reason whatsoever. But like I said, my brain, my brain feels funny. My brain feels strange. Get out of the way, cast Penny. Nobody loves you. Cherry friend. Killing enemy has a 20% chance to drop a cherry familiar. Those cherries emit a charming fart when enemies walk over them and drop a half heart when the room is cleared. Not actually that good for us there, but fruit cake. Oh, baby. Fruit cake is one of my favorite items of all time. Boo shakalaka. Do you know what? Let's blow up the mirror as well. Why not? We are. Give me that extra reflected item chance. Why don't you? Give it to me, baby. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. No, thank you. Oh, yes. Fruit cake. So I'm not that bothered that I left my hive head now that I've got this. I. God damn it. The only reason I I feel bad about that is because people are gonna people are gonna be mean to me about it. Um and say, you dumbass. I I'm gonna see if I can get a reroll in the shop. I really don't wanna have to take that. Damn it. No reroll in the shop. Yeah, I just I, I just think we don't take it. I know that it's HP, but I, I'd rather keep horror Babylon Babylon. Babylon activated because the damage that we have right now from horror Babylon is pretty Integral to our build even though we do have fruitcake now, which is obviously a significant damage increase overall All of y'all that are saying I don't use fruitcake because it can hurt you sometimes need to need to check yourself Automatically uses space for items when they're fully charged. Ooh, that's kind of interesting um, Wooden cross is also really good Angel devils and treasure rooms will always contain a burger. The type depends on the room. That's also really cool. And burn meal. All good stuff if you manage to carry more trinkets. But at the minute, I, I don't know what it, exactly what it's doing. But I'm liking the uh, the Tom page with their uh, Book of Virtues. It seems like a good idea to have this. Another soul heart. I don't know if that's Glyph of Balance giving us that or what. We do need some keys. So I will do this. Make sure we don't pick up the red hearts by accident. You bastard. Walked right into that one. Quite literally. It keeps buffing up the Book of Revelations one. That one doesn't even shoot. Stop. Okay, pop in here. 2020, baby. Oh my god. Anything that makes us shoot more tears with fruitcake is very toppest of tier. So this, this room kind of got out of hand quickly, didn't it? Now check this. Unfortunately, that's not our secret room. I was hoping it would be, but whatever. Probably going to be just to the left here. Look at this. Oh, it's nutty. Ooh, that's a full heal. I don't want that. Weird when you're playing as Eve like this. Oh, my God. I just basically hurt myself. That was stupid. Um, Check in here. Placebo? Eh? It's potentially good, but I don't really think it's really my style right now. Hey, there you go. Back up to full HP again. Yeah, we really need to get rid of these red hearts, but we're only going to be getting angel deals from now on, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, this hyper-buffing familiars thing seems like a really cool idea for an angel item. I really like the idea. Spurders. Gotta love them. I wonder if the spiders can get hyper-buffed, considering... 
Wisps count as familiars, which they don't normally to familiar items. Oh, god damn it. Hello, reflected chest. Yes, please. Wasn't that lucrative, I'll be honest, but there you go. Kind of annoying that we ended up going to all the extra rooms. Do you know what? Let's do let's do the, the boss first before we go reroll our item room. Just remember to go back to the item room this time, you dullard. Ooh, hell yes. Godhead baby that could randomly get buffed. Sounds good to me. Also, like, I don't know what the chances of this guy getting buffed are when we've got all these wisps, but I like the idea of it. Hey, Book of Jubilees is great. Oh, I got a golden pill? Ranger. Puberty. Amnesia. Yuck. Oh, no, it was Yum. And it made me pick up a heart. That's so evil, game. Oh, full health. All the silver. HP up. Tears down? I feel stomping. You little bastard. Wait, it, it took away quite a lot of... Oh, there, tears up. It took away quite a lot of my soul hearts there. And needles. Oh, that's my voice. Cyanide. Cyanide. Range, Range down. down and it's gone. I don't know how good that was. I want to see the I want to see the the godhead baby get big. I want to see him get very large. Do you know what? Let's we're going to have to do a sort of giga brain play here. But I'm willing to I'm willing to sit here and make it work. There you go. You see? Just takes a little patience, people. Just takes a little patience. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. God damn, where is my item room at? Have I seen it already and just don't remember? Was it where I got 2020? Was it where I'm pretty sure it was where I got 2020, wasn't it? Damn, we did lose a lot of damage there, unfortunately. We're down to two damage. That's a big oof. I'm pretty sure it was. Yep, it was. I'm stupid. I, my brain. It's not in the right place right now. Ah. It's just, I don't know what's going on with it, but something ain't right. Ah, the secret room's very clearly here as well. God damn it. Anyways, we move on. I'm going to take this because pills have, pills have been okay-ish. I feel stumpy. It's my voice. It's weird. Oh, boy. We hit Horror Babylon and got a bunch of clotties. That's so good. Speed down. It's me. <laughs> That's so strange. I like it, but I hate it. It's kind of it's kind of scary <laughs> hearing my own voice, but it's also really cool. Yeah, having having a lot of boys here, having a, a whole heap of a whole heap of children following me around. Quite like it, especially considering it put me in horror Babylon. I appreciate it. Uh, no, unidentified pill for double. No, thank you. Ooh, it would have been nice to have the hearts for that guy, though, I will I will admit, so... But then again, look at the ultimate destruction that we're putting forth right now. What a great idea for a pill, by the way. What a great idea for a pill. Yeah. We'll just bring any hearts we get to you. We'll let you deal with them. But yeah, we're having an absolute field day here with Fruitcake. It's, it's kind of great. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, that charge is your active too. Wow. Okay, didn't let me give away all my hearts, which is a little sad. But we did get flight, which I'm pretty happy about. And spectral, which is also very, very good. Oh, I haven't been looking out for my Book of Jubilees procs. There's one of them. Golden Penny. I love the little flying... Flying orb boys. That's so cute. But yeah, having Spectral on all these guys now is pretty amazing. We can kind of keep them safe over the, the safety of rocks. The Mitre. Okay, we are getting some top tier items right now. And Fruitcake. You poppeth off, my kid. You poppeth off. We don't, we don't even need good damage. We have two damage. And Fruitcake is just stealing the show. Yeah, I've put myself back up to full health, because honestly, why not? Might as well wait until we get like a blood bank or something. I still haven't seen my godhead baby get big. I, I'm really I'm really hoping we see him like 
enlarge at some point. See him end biggin. Shop, what do you hold for me? You do give me a foiled card. It's a foiled emperor. I can't remember what that does. Teleports you to the boss room stat boost for the room. Okay, that's not that useful. Um, spawns an extra item in shops. These items are money themed. Nah, let's keep rolling. Dreamcatcher. Keep rolling. Ooh, -hoo -hoo, champion medal. Definitely keep rolling. Tarot cloth, you say. Foiled emperor again, you say. The D stock. Mmm. D stock is pretty good. But we keep rolling. Car battery. Hell yes. I know that we don't have an active that really works with car battery, but hell yes. I love car battery so much. Right, all these boys are like one hit away from from perishing, but we're hoping for the best for them. Look at them, with their little round faces. They're so innocent. You wouldn't hurt them, would you? Would you? Oh my god. We're like killing the stonies and everything. This is just kind of crazy. Another luck penny. A card of nondescript. Reroll that bad boy. Blood puppy, my baby. My boy. My sweet, chubby, chubby lad. Return to me. My chubbiest of boys. Oh my lord. Oh my lord, we have a lot of damage. Considering we have two damage, we have a lot of damage. <laughs> also, I think we're producing extra wisps now because of car battery, so it does kind of work. We got a card out of killing that guy. I'll reroll that. Yeah, chocolate bars are um, some good stuff for us. Hanged men. Let's go. Oh my god, this is just a spice fest of a run. These are the runs where it's like, I don't even think our power is really attributed to anyone. Like, it's not like because we're playing a modded run that we're this strong. Like, obviously the pill's been very good for us spawning as all these boys. But otherwise, nothing in our list really has completely taken us over over the edge. This is just a genuinely very, very strong run. It would have been vanilla. Uh, it would have been very strong in vanilla also, yeah. It's just enhanced by the modded stuff. I see you there, Dominic. I know your games. Ooh, and we can smelt the torn page. Hell yes. Thank you. Smelting the torn page here. Essentially giving us a... Oh, ho, ho, look at Blood Puppy. He's the biggest lad you've ever seen. <laughs> he is my gargantuan fella. My gargantuan queen. Oh, we got Blood Bag. <laughs> I just want to get rid of this HP for fuck's sake. I'll take it, but I'm not happy about it. Now, nah, to be honest, it doesn't really matter at this point. We just got our damage up anyways as well, so... As long as we can keep some of our lads alive for like a decent amount of time, we're going to be sitting pretty for a while here. Oh my god, we got another luck penny. It's kind of crazy. I might reroll you. I will see. Oh, hoo -hoo. replace all heart containers with soul hearts. Hell yes. Give me that horror Babylon. That's brilliant. Not only do we get three free hits per floor, and it's a Hollow Knight reference, <laughs> but we just oh, also it turned off our music briefly. That's weird. That's kind of spooked me out a little bit. Um, but the big get removed all of those red hearts, those pesky red hearts. Empty page. 
Books now active activate a random active item on use. Doesn't proc items that reroll hurt or kill you apart from natural spawning has a trick. So we we got the two pages. I if this works with um with Book of Virtues, by the way, this is gonna be kind of crazy. I doubt it does because we get to use another active, but that would be pretty nuts. We'll we'll find out pretty soon, I'm sure. Crumpled ticket, no thank you. Crumpled ticket means that all we'll get all our cards turn into scratch cards, which is pretty jank. I didn't see another active, uh, active effect there. Although we did get another Wisp, I think. Unless that's the one from earlier, and we just still got it. Which would be kind of nuts, if that's the case. Right, it seems that we've lost most of our boys, sadly. Another Luck Penny. You do realise you don't have to just spawn Luck Pennies. School bag, hell yes. Okay, I kind of did this thinking we'd have enough rooms left to get our charges back to, to uh, enough to do the boss, but I don't think we do. Reflected Temperance card. That would have been good earlier, but right now it's not so good. Although, actually, saying that, we get a free hit, we pop one, and we pop another, and then we slam a bomb down. Bob's your uncle's dad. Pretty good stuff, right? Uh, I'm going to go and do my cash room, just because we have two free hits, so we can get at least one on the way out. Oh, a big boy again. Uh, and it might give us a, it might give us a, a room clear, a little chargey charge. It did indeed, nice. And we got the black doll as well, which I actually respect. I like the black doll. Yeah, I'll have to bug report that this turns off the music. It's not a huge issue, because I imagine next floor will return to normal. Okay. And at least we've got Horror Babylon back, so we don't have to worry about losing all our damage of our blobby, plotty boys, because now we've actually got real damage. Not great damage, but real damage. Okay, um... We are going to the lamb. Ooh, first time seeing this bad boy. Hey, we have a chance to be imprisoned. Imprisoned enemies refract Isaac's tears like the angelic prism. I've been waiting to see this item for so long. Look at that, look at that. You see it? Reflect, reflected. It's so cool. Ooh, hello. Definitely re-rolling both, see what we get. Battle Royale is unfortunately not very good. Good old friend is at least a full re-roll. I do want to see if this will make a new Wisp. It did, but it's a generic Wisp, sadly. Right, down we go. Oh my god, this is uh, quite the spice fest we got going on right here. Like, it's just quality 4 item after quality 4 item after quality 4 item. But yeah, we're going to get these reflected, refracted tears, whatever you call them. Not, yeah, it's reflect, refract, 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 Um, Yeah, they do this little prism effect, and it's fucking awesome. And it's an Ipecac item. I don't know if it was new to Repentance. Um, new to... Um, not Repentance, new to the Repentance update of Ipecac, or if it's always been an Ipecac and I've just not seen it before. But I've been waiting for so long to see it because it's such a cool idea for an item and just seems awesome. And I finally got it. It does seem, by the way, that the torn page doesn't work. Uh, which is honestly fine, because that would be kind of crazy if it did. Look at that. Oh my lord. We'll take perfection, honestly. Um, Death Sacrifice isn't really something we need. I'll take that. Okay, it doesn't permanently convert, convert all your health to soul hearts. I thought it did. Anyways, get out of here. Let's get out of skadoodle. But all that extra luck is going to amount to something or other. I don't actually know if we have any luck-based effects, I'll be honest. But we'll see how long we can keep it going. How about that? Hey, good old glitch heart. I do not want a burn heart, honestly. I don't. Okay, these enemies can be a little fricked. Be careful. Hey, crane machine. Okay, I think we just wail on this crane machine. There you go. Boom. And boom. 
Wait, which is the mallet that we got? Ah, okay. There's like three different mallets. There's like one that splits splits pickups into their base form. There's that one that like that you can slam down. And there's another one that you can use to create items within item pools that have varying costs. It's There's, there's, there's three different types of mallets and it gets real strange. And I think two of them have the exact same name as well. So yeah, it just gets a little funky. Hey, I like this room. It's a cool idea for a room. Magic 8-Ball? I'll reroll Magic 8-Ball. Hypercoagulation isn't that good, but I'm going to take it anyways. I mean, no, to be fair, it's incredibly good. It's just not very good for us. In fact, actually, we might be able to, um, we might to get some cheeky sauce out of it here. Oh, this does use up our three free hits, though. Uh, do you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it. I don't care. Mainly because I just want to show up the hypercoagulation cheese. As long as you have enough speed to pick up the red heart before it disappears, you have infinite players on these things. I did lose one of them there. Depends which way it bounces really, doesn't it? I'm a fucking idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. So I just looked at my HP and was like, hey, up, wait a minute. I was like, wait, wait, wait a bag of flipping minute. And then it hit me. And then I realized. Yeah, uh, you take full heart damage on this floor, so hypercoagulation doesn't work on the womb. And I was just spending all my soul hearts. Yeah, that's, a, that, that's what we call a burn-headed move right there. Imagine if I'd killed myself by accident doing that. That'd be so funny. Anyways, let's continue as on as if nothing happened. I think I lost Horror Babylon as well. We might need to empty this, um, empty this burn heart. Oh, doesn't matter. I got hit. I lost perfection. No, not perfection. Accidentally slept in a bed that spawned on top of me. You know how it be. Do you know when you accidentally sleep in a bed? I do it all the time. Oh, we got the, the big godhead boy then. Ooh, it's a uh, shit muncher o'clock. Oh, you big ugly bitches. Go redesign yourself, you big pricks. Right, let's keep it going. Oh, he's he's big and he's angry. He's big and he's angry. Oh, that's a that's a lot of tears you're producing there, my lad. That's a lot of tears. It seemed to quell our boy's anger quite quickly. Ooh, this is a, a the rarest of double rerolls. Okay, there's something going a little bit wrong with the uh, the whole prism thingy, my bobby. Soul locket is pretty good. Hell yes, I'll take that. Soul chain's good, but I don't think it really does much for us, unfortunately. Right, we're going down. God damn, this has been a sauce pot of a run and a half, and I love it. Do you know, like, I do this a lot where I, like, I get a bunch of sort of topics lined up in my head to talk about in the episode that are unrelated to Isaac, and I'm like, cool, I got some little... Little topics here and there, backlogged, ready to go at. And then the run just pops the fuck off. And I'm like, just talking about Isaac the whole time. But, at the same time, I feel like most people that are watching this series on the regular kind of know what they're in for in terms of the commentary. So, it kind of, it kind of just flows, oh god damn it. it. kind of just flows and makes sense to you guys. So, I don't really worry about it too much. That's kind of one of the things I've kind of, over time, gotten to realize um, is the you schmucks will watch anything? No. Um, but essentially, as, but what what I'm saying is, um, I kind of gotten to realize I don't need to like hyper focus on being, like trying to force being entertaining or force having a story, because people seem to enjoy the videos whether I have a great story or not, and it kind of makes me think, oh shit, I don't need to like 
think of something that happened to me uh, like two years ago and retell the story. If I can, then that's great. But if I don't manage to, or don't think of something um, that's quite going to fit the video or whatever, it doesn't quite slip into conversation naturally, then I don't really... I shouldn't have picked, put that, picked that up really, should I? Uh, I don't really uh, fret about it too much because um, you guys seem to enjoy the videos nonetheless, so... Oh, damn. Foiled card. Ooh, traveling salesman. Hell yes. Oh, it used it twice as well. Uh, sulfuric, bad boys. Hell yes. Um, let's reroll these. Ooh, kidney stone. Hell yes. Reroll IBS. Ooh. Um, Dr. Fiertus. I don't really think. We not. We want you. Tinted rocks, anybody? Tinted rocks? You can get a single tinted rock, I don't think. Oh no, we did, we did, we did. Hey, we got a small rock too, hell yeah. That was like a pretty good payout from that traveling salesman. I mean, there was two of them, so it was a little better than normal, but still. But yeah, sulfuric acid is pretty top tier for me. Uh, what's left? Oh, it's you, hello. I apologize for disregarding you. Alright, how does this thing work? Can I soul bond these guys? Oh, I've been tap firing. Like, just like normal and not firing my real tears. Because I forgot I had kidney stone. Whoops. Okay, it doesn't work on bosses. Yeah, if I'd have just used that on the, the enemies earlier, they'd have been dead very quickly. There you go. Big boy is gone. Bing bong, he gone. Right, what are we gonna get? I'm guessing Sinner's Heart, Mum's Knife, um, Dark Bum, and Demon Baby. Wrong. 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 <laughs> I think we'll just take this. And we'll re-roll the rest. See what we get. Okay, let's uh, get ready for this. Oh, ho, 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 yes. Ooh, I've, uh, I've never done that before. I've accidentally jammed that item directly into the door. Poison tears, you say. I don't think we need that right now, but interesting prospects. Thank you for uh, regarding me. Oh, my lord. Do you remember we get three free, three free uh, hits of floor, so we're good until then. And we just got a soul heart and a black heart, so... Don't know how we end up coming out of that room with more health having been hit. Whoa, I did not see the brimstone boys underneath that. Wait, no, I didn't get hit. What happened? I am confusion. We are just slip slapping boys right now. Also, look at the big boy. Dude, come on. Stop being a jabroni. Thank you. Spider baby. Gotta have that spider baby. Yeah, the the angelic prism thingy, it's it's pretty whack. There seems to be some uh, some slightly glitchy behavior going on with it. I'm not sure if that's as a part of my other items that I've got going on or what, but seems to be some sauce, some some definite sauce. But yeah, I've never managed to do this here where I've like opened an item do like literally directly on a door. Are you ready? Are you ready for love? Oh, don't you love it? The absolute destruction. Oh, can't calm down you. Come on. God damn, the ocular rift as well is so good. Um, Boom, 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 bow. All stats up. Hell yes. That just works for us. And we got a soul heart in this room to commemorate it. Thank you. Oh, look at that. One big one, absolutely deaded. Two big ones, not quite deaded. It, it does seem quite common that enemies are prismed as well. I seem to be getting like one, at least one every room, maybe more. Maybe turn that back a little bit. Volatar. Volatar is an item I feel like I almost never see. Then again, I do play a lot of modded, so... 
What is this room that already has chests in it? Also, I have to think that picking up the saw blade item, probably a bad idea. This item gets a little wacky. Oh, although they're kind of de- they're kind of despawning as I fire them for some reason. I'm not quite sure why that is. Alexa, baby. Use him before he gets nerfed. I'm pretty sure he's getting nerfed in the next Ipecac update. He is very, very strong. Boom. Ooh, we found a secret room. Hello. A little R key for me, maybe. To be honest, I probably wouldn't want the R key. Oh, I prismed my baby. We did get rock bottom, however. Which with kidney stone is pretty, pretty popping. Let's just, uh, let's just check this out. Right. We wait until we get kidney stone. Come on, kidney stone. You know you want to. Fill up with rage. Come on now. There you go. And release. There you go. That's our fire rate permanently now. Um, I'm getting hit by a lot of explosions right now. Yeah, this is just our permanent fire right now. So we ended up getting rock bottom in a way that actually ended up working for us. I am getting hit by a lot of shiitake right now. I, I cannot fathom what's going on. Bit. Hey, lamb. How are you doing? Not doing so well, are we? Not doing so well, are we, lamb? Who's my little lammy, lammy, lammy? There you go. That just about calls it. What a great run. Rock bottom to end it off. Hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one.